Hey guys, what's up, Cancer? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. Could be an earth sign, so flip it how you need to. Could be around work and finances for some as well. All right, so cancer. Oh, shoot. All right, let's just keep going. So remember, it's a general reading. Just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. It does resonate. Please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Ooh, you got the power. Oh, yeah. So there may have been like a rejected invitation or somebody that turned something. Somebody could have went straight cold shoulder there. But this is this is like wanting to manifest something that's like a reunion, a get together, something like that. But then it's possible for whatever reason that was missed. It could have been financially. Oh, shoot. Okay. Maybe a future for cancer. There's our King of Pentacles and Three of Pentacles again. So you could be dealing with the Earth sign. For some, it could be around work or, or some type of like project that you're doing with others. Sorry. All right. Shoot. Sorry. One more for the outcome for cancer. They're all flying. Six of Swords. Some of you could be moving. Could be traveling. Oh, the Six of Swords is usually pulling away from rocky times. Looks like somebody's trying to make plans, work with you on something. Could be somebody that you work with or some type of like group project, um, collaboration type thing. The Ace of Pentacles. I'm sorry, the Ace of Cups. All right. So you could be meeting somebody that's brand new. And this is, this is real love. It could be rekindling because wow somebody's doing a lot of focus on self-love like they're worried about worried they ain't the word for it about finances or like about their self but this type of energy would be one to worry about security so finances kind of make sense there but there's a really strong bond between you and someone here and with that ace of cups it can be somebody that's brand new, or this could be somebody maybe that's kind of just focusing on work, career, and self-love right now. Show me this um, Three of Pentacles for Cancer, please. Knight of Wands. Oh, shoot. And the star, Aquarius, energy. Somebody's holding on to hope, wow. If you are doing like a group project or something like that, um, that could that can bring in some money real quick. If this is a person, they they want to offer, they want to like work on stability, security. This is somebody who's very protective, but it looks like this is something around work. With the three of pentacles, the eight of pentacles, the ten of pentacles, but well, we got the love over here, so. Take it how it's going to resonate because around work, there's about to be a big payoff. And around love, this person wants to work on, make plans, and actually put in the effort towards something that's really secure, really stable. You have multiple people competing for you. And somebody's had you on their mind lately. Been thinking about you a lot. All right, show me the Six of Swords for Cancer, please, for the outcome. This is a very stable, secure energy. All right, we have the Six of Swords and now the Seven of Swords. Huh. All right, and the wheel. All right. There's around work this is cool right you could be moving traveling making plans um growth expansion working with others like collaborating around relationship this is something man i think somebody was a player before or um had ties somewhere else 
because it feels like for some, and if this is in yours, don't take it. There's a third party, like I said, and somebody was in and out. And somebody kind of walked away. This chapter closed. And now somebody could be like returning or making a decision here on like they want to work on something. What is the Seven of Swords for love? Around career and finances. I mean, you could just be moving forward, creating plans, making a strategy, that type of thing. But, uh, and the wheel will be great because that's growth and expansion. But I want to see what that Seven of Swords is for love because that's how all this started. The fool. Think things through. Trust your instinct. Yeah, there's that five of swords. Somebody was stubborn, hard headed, now they're stressing out of their mind. Um, but you have the seven of swords and the five of swords. We started with the six of swords. We're supposed to kind of be moving towards a peaceful time, but this looks more like somebody's traveling, moving forward, and um this is this just be mindful of intent. Because it's coming back as a real kind of stubborn, hard-headed energy. But this, this is two kind of sneaky cards. So just make sure, like, I don't want to say motive, but um, give me one more for the outcome. Because I want to I wanna know. I mean, if we go off the literal definition of those cards, that's like winning at all costs, why cheats steal. But this feels like, um, I don't know, just be mindful, the King of Swords. Somebody could be doing some investigating type energy, this Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Um, and somebody may get angry, especially if you got choices there. Somebody's going to, you know, they may get their heart broke. And uh, it's not you, but there's there's a choice here. And it doesn't have to be that it's third party. I mean, it looks like you have actually multiple people wanting your attention. So it's very possible the choice is yours. All right, Cancer. I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.